Hey everyone, welcome back to this brand new video uploading here on the channel of Game Time Life. Now in this video, as you might have seen on the thumbnail, I'm going to be showing you the components for two super cool male tryhard or free mode outfits. So let's get straight into it. Now my voice is still a little bit different because I still have this nasty cold, so yeah, that's why. But I'm going to be trying my best to explain this all to you guys. So basically I'm going to be showing you the components only in this video. We're going to be working with one slot outfit, which makes it a lot easier if you want to transfer multiple ones. So you have to merge these outfits, but they are like one slot components, so that makes it really easy. So this has been done with the creator outfit transfer glitch. If you, doesn't know, if you don't know how that works, the link for that will be in the description box down below. So let's get started with the components. So we're going to be starting on the second female character, and if you already have one created, make sure that you've been on your main male character first, and then just swap over to your second character. So for the very first outfit, we're going to be creating the white and black outfit. So for that, you want to go over to the pants section on the second female character, go over to the sports pants, and you want to put on the spotted muscle pants. And these will allow us to merge our pair of black joggers. So now we're moving over to the top section, and from here you want to go to the sports jackets and put on the dark blue Guffy puffer. And this will be our white bigness t-shirt component. So then we're moving over to the bus cheers and make sure you put on the teal lace bus cheer, which is the white fast shirt component, which will give us the ripped shirt effect. So now you want to move over to the shoes, go into the boots and put on the crimson cowboy boots. And these will give us the white racing suit shoes. So now you want to go over to the accessory section and to merge or black desert scarf, you want to put on the black and white deco earrings. Now as soon as you've applied that, you want to open up the interaction menu, go to inventory, go to body armor, and you simply want to put on the heavy armor in order to merge or black CEO armor. So then these are the components for the white and black outfits. You want to go ahead and save that on slot number one, and then we're moving over to the red and the black version of this outfit. So for the red and black version, almost all the components stay the same. The top components will change and the shoe components will change. So you want to return back over to the top section. You want to go back into the sports jackets. And from here, you want to put on the red puffer jackets. And this one will give us the sports top with the red lines on it. Then you want to back out and you want to go back over to the bus cheers and you want to put on the white lace bus cheer, which is the black fast shirt component. So as soon as you've got that bus cheer on, you want to back out and now you want to move over to the shoes section. So inside the shoes section, go to the boots and put on the worn chocolate slack boots, which give us the red Tron shoes. So now, again, you want to make sure that you have that heavy armor applied and you have those spotted muscle pants on and you have the earrings on this outfit. So then this will be the components for the red and black outfits. So then these will be the two outfits set for the two outfits on the thumbnail and you are now ready to transfer them over. So what you want to do is apply the very first outfit, then you want to walk outside and make your way into creator. And then from here do the creator outfit transfer glitch. So I've included this a lot on the channel. So you must know basically how it works. And like I said, the link for that will be in the description box down below. Test your race, then just delete the character, return to story mode and go back to a online session. So I'm quickly going to be transferring it over and then I'll see you guys back in a second. So I'm back here on the male character and now we're basically ready to merge the white outfit and the red outfit. So here is still the little teaser of the white outfit because I have been working on it. And basically what you need before you can merge is you need to apply the black joggers and the black CEO vest. And you can get that through a mission and you have to join as the third player basically. I will leave the glitch to like get the CEO armor and the pair of black joggers in the description box down below. And like I said, make sure that you join as the third player. 
So now again, you want to put on the black desert scarf and you can do that through your interaction menu. Just go to scarves and put on the scarf. And then you want to leave this outfit on and we're going to be merging the very first outfit. So for the very first outfit, you want to walk outside of the closed door and just simply open up the pause menu and go to the Crooked Cop mission. Now on the Crooked Cop mission, if you're hosting it, make sure that you set clothing over to player own it. And if you're joining somebody else's Crooked Cop, make sure that the current host has also set clothing to player own it. So as soon as the job is all launched up and you're on the screen right here, you can now choose the outfit. So go over to own that outfit and all you have to do is go once to the right. Now for me, nothing changes, but you should see the white shirt with the white vest shirt and everything all glitched together for this black and white version. So you want to hit ready to play and then just take this outfit straight inside Crooked Cop. And all you have to do in Crooked Cop is open up the interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories and put on a rebreather. Now what I did is I also added the pair of black gloves that I wanted to it. So as soon as you're done with this, then you can now pull up the phone and just return back over to an invite-only session by quitting the job or a public session, doesn't matter. So as soon as you are back, you now want to remove the outfit slot for the black and white outfit. So that's what I'm going to be doing right here. And what I did is I finished off the outfit with a black tight ski mask and the white bulletproof helmet. Now to get the colored helmets, I will leave a link in the description box down below with the updated method that was uploaded. So now we're going to be merging the red and black outfits. So for that, you do not have to change anything. You want to leave that pair of black joggers on, the black battle vest and the black desert scarf. And you want to return back over to Crooked Cop and basically do the same thing. Find a job which has clothing set to player own it or launch it up by yourself and invite a player and set it to player own it. Now as soon as the job is launched up and you're on the screen right here, again scroll over to own it outfit and go once to the right and then you have yourself the red outfit. So hit ready to play and again take this outfit inside of the Crooked Cop job. So here in the Crooked Cop job again I'm going to be applying the pair of gloves of my choice. And as soon as I've did that, then I'm also going to be putting on the mask that I want on this outfit. So for that, I'll be using the charcoal toggle ski mask. So as soon as you've applied that or like a rebreather, whatever that you want on it, again, pull up the phone and quit the job. And once you're back in an online session, you can again save this outfit and finish it the way that you want it. So what I did is I added the red bulletproof helmet, of course, over to this outfit. Like I said, link will be in the description box down below. So here are what the two tryhard male outfits look like. We have the white version and the red version of this outfit. So this also ends the tutorial on how to get these. If it worked for you, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel of Game Time Life for more glitches and outfit tutorials, and turn on post notifications to get informed with the latest uploads. And I hope to see you back in the next video here on the channel. Bye everyone!